Sigurd Jarl, back where you belong. Oh, I missed you, my brother. Yeah, you missed me? Yeah. Once or twice a year. What? It took you time to find me. Was it for this? To enjoy your time on my throne? I did only what you asked of me. And you slew all those who questioned you. That is not what happened. Ranvi, Ranvi will tell you. Oh, yeah. We'll see. My dear wife. Brought to me as a gift by her clan to pacify my ambition. Yes, I'm sure she will be the one to tell me the truth. What did that witch, Fulke, do to you? You cannot even begin to imagine the things I've seen. What I've learned. Born of gods is who I am. A lord of war. A Roman Mars. I know who I am, I know my destiny, and you will not hinder me! Brother... Forgive me. I am faint. Tired of the day and all that has passed. I need air. He's been this way since his return. Could you speak with him? Settle his mind? I can try. Stand with cheer, one and all! Today is a day of celebration! Our Jarl is with us! Tonight, let us drink and eat, in honor of his return. And now, I will delight you with a poem in praise of the man. And Where is Sigurd gone? In my eyes. I will delight you with a poem in praise of the man. A new composition of my own. His mood is dark. What are you doing here? I was looking for you. Sigurd. Dark died defending my honor? So he claimed. Then he was a fool. My honor needs no defense. It is stone solid. Unblemished. I offered him a way out. But... Shh. Say nothing more of the past. It is gone. There is a rift as deep as death between then and now. I was tested, Eivor, in a crucible of blood and fire. And in my agony, I was reborn. You may think me less than I was. But this is not so. I am greater than before. My mind is a wellspring of prophecies. Visions that tell me who I truly am. For all that, I am grateful for my suffering. Sigurd, I want to understand. But all this, all you say makes little sense. Basim saw these things in me. Fulke, too. Despite her cruelty, she spoke the truth. I am more than the man I was. More than this hobbling stick that stands before you. You must look harder, Eivor. Deeper. See for yourself what they found in me. Do you see it? My greater self. 
I... I don't know what that means. Look! This is the face of a god. I see only my brother and my truest friend. Return to where he is loved and cherished. Where he's meant to be. You are kind. But your eyes are clouded by the past. A place I can no longer see. I fear our paths diverged long ago. Go. I wish to be alone. Return to my feast and drink for me. Celebrate the days to come in my name. like I have a new letter. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Ranvi. Best tell her the good news. You look well. What happened yesterday? You and Sigurd disappeared during the feast. And when he returned, he went straight to our room without a word. We talked for a time. I asked many questions, but got few answers. I wish I could say more. Sigurd wants to blame me for every mishap that has befallen him, but gives me no credit for his rescue. I don't understand. Yet he does speak with you. With me, he has gone totally silent. So, what now? This is for Sussex. We burned it to the ground to save one man. Yet he's barely the man we were searching for. Quite so. to see the Alliance map. What transpires in Gloucestershire? You may have noticed that Gunnar has disappeared from his forge. He has traveled to Gloucestershire in search of a wife. A wife? He is in love. When did this happen? When doesn't this happen with our dear, lovelorn blacksmith? But there is a bright side. He has asked you to join him. Join his search for a wife. And see that he does not make a fool of himself. I believe he thinks that your presence would bolster his image. All right, I'll be Gunnar's keeper, if only to bring him back in one piece. Very generous of you. Make for the town of Gloucester. You will find him there.
This area is off limits. Look soon in. Stretch your wings, Sunan. Look at this day he did. Oh, 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 
Watch out, you dung eater! Them see come up off dust, we lay each two. There you are, Gunner. And with a smile I haven't seen in some time. Eivor, thought I smelt you under wind. Gunnar, with the speed you left home, I thought you'd been carried off by Valkyries. I have. This Valkyrie right here, Bridget, my own heart's root. Meet Eivor. It takes a rare woman to nail down our Gunnar. Bavadinta, with my Zigwili. Uh, good to meet you as well. How did you find a woman in these backwoods? She came through the settlement selling runes, outshone every stone in her satchel. She offered me a trade, a rune for a brooch I was making. I got a better deal. But she loves the ugly little thing. Have you a family, Bridget? If mama dad cut it even gilder than Anun, couldn't have drews me. Bricks of man power, the last high priestess and elderman. They since passed on. But the current elderman looks out for her. I should like to meet this elderman of yours, if our kinfolk are to be joined. A union forged in love. Come, we go find him. Oh, and don't blame me if he's heard a tale or two about you. What about it, Bridge? Tim Jolch, you two bags of air see gumpas gillet. That Eivor Gal Cleese Lown. Right, no daylight to waste then, huh? So the Elderman may have heard a tale or two about my exploits. Not all from me. Your name will be on the lips of every skull for years to come. <laughs> and the merchants here are not unsettled by lurking Vikinger. They come from all over to celebrate Sawen. Most are too busy with the festivities to pay us mine. Sawan? Is that what these cab roots are for? This tradition? Aye. Faces cut into lanterns to ward off evil spirits and guide children home. They have a haunted look about them. But spring a few back. There is the elder man, Kunan. A good leader, seeing to his people's needs. Let us join hands when his task is done. Yeah, then let's introduce you to Tevder. Hands as clammy as a dead haddock, but his heart is in the right place. And he'll be Elderman after Kuna. Tevder, this is Eivor, my chieftain. Ah, yes. The way Gunnar speaks, I expected, uh... Me to ride in on a winged horse, cure the sick and the blind. His compliments are as blunt as his hammer. Ah, more pagans crowding our table. Just lovely. Well, what brings you here? I'm here to hasten my friend's marriage and drink my weight in ale. If friendship comes afterwards, then all the better. And what has Dane friendship done for Christian Mercia? Unseated god right kings for puppet rulers? So-called puppet kings keep your land safe and your bellies full. I ask no thanks, only hospitality. A apples! Eivor! Wait until you try the cider. You you like cider, eh? Tevder? Cider? <sighs> ah, you must be Eivor. Tevder, I see you've welcomed our honored guest. Come just in time for my last Samhain. At your behest. We welcome all pagans set upon God's own Gloucester. Tevder! 
As your harvest king, I demand that you remove the turnip from your arse and be merry. So you've come to meet the family before you whisk my Bridget away to her life as a smithy's bride. We're honored to have her join the Raven Clan, but your lush landscape will be hard to match. I must give away girl and land in this misty season, but Gunnar is a good man, and he speaks tirelessly of you. If you will excuse me, I have matters to attend to. Ah, yes, the shrine. And with so many thieves and fangs on the path, a fellow may fall in God's service. Kunod, I do not need a heathen escort. Youth cut down in its prime, without even the memory of warm thighs and cider to sustain him in the afterlife. Then by my honor, I shall not rest until I return him to you safely. I, Tefter? I see I am outmatched. Though it deign joining in praise to Saint Kenhelm, God will weep. My lady love calls, Eivor. Oh, if you'd like to join us later, we're going hoodening this eve. Go, may you have a fire-forged friendship. Watch for fairies, fenfolk, and fiends. I have a hand fastening to oversee, an apprenticeship to officiate, and a pig to slaughter. <clears throat> well, shall we then? Sowen. <laughs> Kunon humors these pagans too much. It is the first thing gone when I am Elderman. Fires and magic. Spirits in the air. Gloucestershire has strayed from God's light. People need carousing, especially before the winter frost. The festival brings warmth and cheer. God's light does not dim as the nights chill. But the winters are hard upon the children. Seeing them run around... It lightens the heart. Are there priests in your lands? I've met a few, liked even fewer. The profane has gone unchallenged here. I alone am the reformation. They are a flock in need of my shepherding. And how will you lead this great renewal? They will fill the church's pews and we will thank him for all the gifts he brings. Not false idols of wood and clay. And yet, are we going to pray at the idol of another? Is this Saint Kenelm your god? No, and we do not call him such. He is simply closer to the Lord's ear. Lo, in a mead of kine under a thorn, lieth poor Kenhelm, kingborn. Is this land not beautiful, Abel? I... Look, the path is untouched by danger, so your company is not needed. You're a kinder man than the mask you wear. You won't be rid of me. I'll keep my word to Kunan for your safe return. I don't understand this Christian praying. I thank Odin while standing. Why get your knees dirty? To humble ourselves before God. Besides, I've dirtied my knees doing worse. That sounds like a tale I'd like to lend my ear to. Please, Eivor, I must pray. Should I watch or turn my back? Oh, Lord, gift upon this lowly servant your greatest gift. Patience. I'll not have to interrupt your prayer to protect you, Teftir. And yet you insist on doing so. What is it you are looking at? A hare? Tefter, get to safety. Find somewhere to hide. Where did they come from? <laughs> Bell the swine! <laughs> Bell the swine. Eivor, thank you for saving my life. It is good I was here to protect you. Maybe Kunan has the eyes of prophecy. Splude, cloven hoofed and sent by Lucifer himself. This land must be returned to God's grace. More likely the shrine is in their territory. Lord, we thank thee for your protection. It's not safe here. Give me my moment's prayer, Eivor. I ask only this. We should return to Gloucester, unless you'd like to thank the little martyr here for tonight's feast. I'm not a babe in the woods in need of constant guard. Go on without me. I gave Kuna. Yes, yes, your word. 
And when I see him, I will say you protected me from being skewered upon those devil's tusks. Oh, and Eivor, I owe you a drink at least. Later, if you'd have one, find me at the festivities. What adventures did you find in my absence? Escorted Tefter to the shrine of some Christian saint. Our path was not peaceful, accosted by a singular of boar. Odd, but path now usually south. To the Brivo. But you saved his hide. I bet it was quite the sight, two of you as a pair. I kept my word to Kunan, and that spatchcock Tevdir lives. Restraint, Eivor? I was half expecting you to wallop the lad around the head and ass. I've bridged hands with most of England, Gunnar. And I've held my temper around worse than Tevdir. I need a drink. Try the cider. It's from last year's apple harvest. Skull. Skull. So, you invited me to a hoodening. What mischief is this? Nigwiskalan fell spread down in creatures of the veil. The bag for treats. Glowashester gives their glut to otherworldly visitors, and if you dress as one, you'll get that bounty yourself. Freely given. <laughs> I've only seen such a thing done at feasts. Then we turn you into a beastie and have you roam the hills, braying for sweets and drink. It's hardly a disguise. Just a cloak and some bones. Nonsense. You are the very spirit of the Mary Louved. Now, let's hooden. Become the Mary Louved, the spirit who sings for cake and ale. And you cannot have your cloak back until we leave. I'll keep this covering. But even a knife to my gunner. If no one else is dressed this way, I'll fill your shot. Go treat! What business have you? Oh, the Mary Lewid. Right, right. We're doing cakes instead of beer this year. Sow in night and the moon is high. Mary Lewid haunts my door. Give me sweets and candied treats, the kind I most adore. <laughs> Here then. Sweets for the Mary Lewid. You've earned it. Are you playing the role of trickster spirit? Can trickster spirit see? Yeah. We should go back to our chat. Can trickster spirit see? The eye holes in this mask are terrible. All it takes is a mask and some sweet cakes to turn you into a gentle skull. I am not going to sing, Gunnar. These sciences go over my... Did it! Oh, thank the gods. We've been waiting for children all night to empty our store so we can go to the party. Have some extra. Ah, lads getting into their cups, scaring the wee ones. Eivor, mighty warrior, knocker of doors, victor of K.
come to rhyme with you. In the gloaming, see her roaming hidden neath the hood. To each dwelling, fate foretelling, it's the Mary Lewitt. Well done. <laughs> Look at these cakes. Sweet as honey, Gunner. You should see this, Gunner. Honor. Oh, damned deserter. Take your false gods and piss off back to your shit smeared hovel. You are either fearless or stupid boy to speak to someone of the Raven clan this way. Fitting name for scavengers. Winged rats taking what isn't yours. I'll pick out your eyes and feed them to your god. Gunner, we are guests here. Let them go. We can hood and more. You seem to want your nose broken, so let me oblige. Christ, him tall. Words, take him! It's you lot we should be burning alive! Are you sure you don't want to see? Four spears! My leg! Gunnar! Beunivalis Macallon! Enough! Keep your brawls to the other side of the river. There's children about. I don't answer to you, witch. Thomas Fletcher, I brought you into this world, wiped your mother's birth blood from your face. Mind your tongue. Let's see that leg, then. It's nothing. Careful with the old man. He's had many winters worth of wounds. To look is. Modron's a gumpas to patch this lad. Your aid is welcome. Men drown themselves in ale on Samhain. But I fear for the fragile peace when Tefter becomes elder men. Is Dean a fool? Regardless of Poise of Puar. That man called you a witch. I lead those who follow the old ways in Gloucestershire. But I offer my healing services on both sides of the river. Gwenith, my love. Go back to the house and bring me the garlic salt. And the worms? Are we cleaning or cutting, mother? Yes, grab the worms just to be safe. Now go, child. I promise not to cut it off before you return. I'll give me strength. My mom modern is known I'm a humor toish gudran. I'm glad you all finding my mortal injury so funny. Go, Eivor. Make Marion try to loosen Tempter's shoulders. Modran. You do not have to save his leg. I'll understand. That limb will be fine. But no medicine in England will stop the dribble from his mouth. I do not work miracles. Hmm. Interesting. Sweet friends, that is a fine way to end a day. Eivor, there you are. Tefter, 
You're well met. Guilim here has challenged my honor in a contest of drinks. Join us. The lad will be easy pickings. Perhaps later, Tefter. I'll find you again and defend my honor and ale. Ready for that drink, Eivor? But fair warning, my reputation will not suffer another blow. Give me a cup. Some ale, then. One for me as well. For a shaveling of the Christ Lord, you have a lot of scars, Quillam. Not every tonsured man is a wet ear, Abbey, babe. I came to God after I had scarred my soul with sin. To holy hearts and humid eyes. It is the best drunkenness returns a man to royal reason. Skull. Pipar, the honor of Glowachester is at stake. I will not leave these lands to one who lacks an ale like a cat. That's foul. Come, lad. The leader of Glowachester should hold more meat than I. Seen babes in arms drink a hogshead of ale faster! Drink, man! Drink! Come on, lad, show the game your metal! This merriment feeds my soul. Here, another drink on me, for allies new and old. Of all the Eldermen I've met, you are the most unburdened. What is your secret? None. It is well known. The burdens I carry will soon leave this world with me. So drink to my life and death. Death? I am to be sacrificed in the Wicker Man as King of the Harvest. Like Elderman Simkin before me, and all before him. Horrible barbaric practice. A burnt offering after poor crops. They hope well-fed gods will smile upon them. A true father sacrifices himself for his people. Gives his all, his blood and flesh. A great honor, but a sad fate. Hmm. When you speak these words, it reminds me of the Christ. Oi, lad. Now you can see how a man like myself sees the value in both. A toast, then. To Elderman Coonan. Joyous and generous. Let each man show him loyalty until he suffers death. My friends, you are kind to me. I'd like to toast my successor, Tevder. May he wear the horns head high. this water i feel like thor chugging ocean snow effect to my head or step <laughs> you heard the woman give her something stronger <laughs> this will work faster than any tonic good give me visions of all creatures that roam these hills and the sore head tomorrow to pay for it wow that tastes awful it feels good though They've all speak true. 
My feelings be damned. I have been an ass. Do not deny it. And I, for that, I am sorry. A colossal horse's ours. Yes. Soft words from the heartless heathen. Only fiercer than fire among ill friends. I can be very as nice as a spring gale. <laughs> and how nice is that? Very, very nice. I think I might like you even better when you're me. Tevter, with Gunnar and Bridget's marriage, our clans will unite. But we could join by oath as well. Oh, yes. My first ally as Elderman. I accept. We shall make an oath. How do we start? Yeah, the greatest, greatest oath and the greatest union. To the oath! The treaty! The greatest! <laughs> People are sleeping. More ale to seal our friendship? <laughs> this way, this way. Look out for the black sow. Sow? Like pig? Flaming pig. Chases you home at night. <clears throat> silly words to scare silly children. Ha! <laughs> you see magic as the stuff of children's dreams. Perhaps I judge too much. Proves I half believe. Foolishness sometimes takes my tongue. I have to piss. <laughs> A great blackness chases stars across the sky in great worlds of color and light. Whoosh! Here we are. Right inside here. I feel warm. Do you feel warm? Always warm here. <laughs> it's a wonder you don't walk around naked. Yes, um... Well... Come on in. Tefter! 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 Where are you? Hell's breath. What happened last night? Ugh. The effects of that draft still cling. Tevder! Are you here? <laughs> <laughs> 